It is indeed your vibe. Ah, oh, dude, I miss Rocket Punch. Yoni's so good. She's so charismatic, funnily enough. Uh, no pun intended, actually. Dude, Kay's voice is so good for this descending vibrato part. It's so good for this part. Hello everyone, what is going on? My name is Anubi Warrior and welcome back to my K-pop reaction channel and today we have the rest of the contestants for Queendom Puzzle. Uh, this is the Charismatic and Snap performances round two. Uh, so they're doing the same songs as last week, but it's teams of few contestants. And we know who's actually officially in the show now. Um, of course, Cheon and Han left, which is really sad because I actually really, 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 really like both of them. Um, but uh, so for round three, or for team three, which is doing Charismatic, uh, we have uh, Dewey from MoMA Land, which is very exciting. To be uh, consistently towards my the top of my bias line, um, especially after Yonlu left uh, for a long time, Tui was my bias. Um, missing Momo Land hours, so that's very exciting. Uh, Toa, which is very exciting uh, because more weekly, <laughs> more weekly, please. I need weekly. Then we have Yonhi, who is my bias wrecker. In Rocket Punch. Uh, love seeing her here. She's absolutely going to destroy me the entire time. Every time she performs, I die. She's insane. Uh, we have Sujin from Weekly. Like I said, missing weekly hours. Uh, Soyeon from Rocket Punch, which is exciting to see. Soyeon from Triple S, who of the Triple S members, I'm not that familiar with, to be honest. Um... But interesting that there's an additional Triple S member. Both Snap and Charismatic together. I don't think anyone will break my brain quite as hard as uh, Yoram, Yen, and Yuki did last week. So it shouldn't be like a 40 minute video. So I should be able to do it in one video. It is possible Chanmi and Churi can break my brain, but here we go. First we got Charismatic. Aw, you need so pretty. Yoni is so pretty! <laughs> Immediately I'm like, Yoni! <laughs> oh, okay! Dude, the way she started off that's that's not fair. The the lip bite, the wink, that's actually unfair. Hey, yo. Yeah, I'm so weak for Yoni, man. I'm so weak. Dude, Yoni... I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm rewinding because Yoni... Maybe this will be a really long video. Maybe it will be. Oh, let's go. By the way, this song has grown on me significantly. Uh, it's worth mentioning because in the first reaction, I was like, I like it, but I don't love it. 
as I've listened to it more, it's just kind of earwormed, and that chorus actually works way better than I initially thought it did, so, yeah. It's the rare grower for me. That's obviously gonna be different with different people singing parts of it, but... It is indeed your vibe. Ah, oh, dude, I miss Rocket Punch. Yoni's so good. She's so charismatic, funnily enough. Uh, no pun intended, actually. Uh, but she's so charismatic. And also attractive. <laughs> yeah, I'm dead. You only exist, therefore I am dead. And you know, I'm weak to the styling in general. It's crops, it's jeans, I'm dead. <laughs> That's a given. Weekly. Yeah, the song grew on me. It actually, it definitely is grown. I interrupt this message to once again remind you that don't he pretty? <laughs> you don't he pretty? Um, that was fun. That was fun. Uh, was hard to pay attention to anyone not uh not so uh, or not uh so uh not Yoni. Uh, everyone killed it. It was fun. Between this and the other performance, um, it's probably unfair to say, but I will say, as Yonhee biased as I am, I think the Jihan actually put in so much work on the other version, so I, I would say the first version I like better. Uh, this was fun, though. They killed it. It was nice. Um, I was a little bit nervous about the rain in the white top, so I'm not going to lie, so I assume... That there's another reason that they got rain and the fireworks and we'll find out in the show but i assume they wouldn't have styled them in the white tops if we were doing rain so it was not a concern uh but i was like uh is water coming <laughs> because we're outfit changing maybe um anyway they killed it it was fun let's jump into snap for this week's version of Snap, uh, it's performed by Team Athena, uh, and this team we have uh, Niru, who I'm not familiar with at all, but it's an NMB48 team, um, team member. Uh, we have K, obviously, big crush on K, uh, kind of fell in love with her on the original Queendom, funnily enough. Um, yeah, big, big crush on K, like, very excited she's on this show. Obviously, Lovely is unfortunately no longer really with us as a group, uh, but uh, big love for Kay. So very excited about that. Uh, we'll be crazy to see her in this kind of context for Snap, 
Um, although I will say, I guess, like, Obliviate was kind of in this vein girl crushy a little bit. Uh, we have Huiso from Haiki. I don't know the Haiki members that well, uh, but uh, exciting. Um, we have Chunmi. Obviously, I I've been crushing on Chunmi since before I knew what K-pop was. Um, <laughs> it'll be weird. I think she's going by a stage name that's not Chunmi. I think she's going by... Oh, what it was it starts with like an f sound i think anyway um so I, that will be an impossible habit to break we're just saying chenny for the purposes of this video i'm sure during the show i will get corrected maybe or i'll just keep saying chenny i don't know um but look i aoa if anyone wants to know my aoa history <laughs> and why i discovered k-pop with idol but i know what aoa is since aoa debuted basically uh, go check out one of my AOA reactions. I explained it in all of them. I don't need to do it in this video. I've been big crushing on Chunmi since uh, before, the, long before this channel existed. Uh, we have Elliot from Wikimiki, which is very exciting. I miss Wikimiki all the time. Where is Wikimiki? Um, sad there's not more members now that I know it was a possibility. Uh, but very, very exciting to see her here. Uh, and Judy. My beautiful, beautiful egg, the world's sexiest egg, uh, fell deeply in love with Jiri during uh, Produce 48. Obviously, already she was a biased contender with Yoni. Um, she's the bias in Rocket Punch. I love her so much. Um, and then we have Hai, who I think is, according to my Discord, and I haven't double-checked this, is a member of a Thai girl group. Uh... And apparently her YouTube, or her name in that group is Fi, and she has, or Faye, and she has a YouTube channel, so I could be wrong, but I believe this is Faye from NKT48, which I think is a tie offshoot of AKB. I don't know, let me know if that's incorrect or correct. Uh, I'm not going to know who she is by just looking, but I guess she'll be the one person that I don't... Well, her and Miru will be the people that I don't recognize at all, uh, because I know the rest of them quite well. Well, Huiso, I don't know that well either. So those three might get confused with each other. The others I should have on lockdown. I'm very excited. It's snap time. Let's jump in. Team Athena. Oh my gosh. We are starting off with Chenmi, of course. Of course. Ooh. Wait, we did not start with chun -Li, I'm a liar. <laughs> it's chun -Li in the red. I I already have failed. Guys, it's been 10 years. Uh, this is why I struggle to recognize people. That's definitely not a chun -Li shot we start with. I'm like 99% certain... That Chenli is... Yeah, 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 this is Chenli. I don't know... Is it Huiso? Maybe that was Huiso we opened with. So I've already failed at the one person that I should know from the most, so... Go figure. Ooh. Yeah, it's me, so. Okay. Intense. The cutouts. I'm dead. Me too. Oh, this choreo is so, so lethal. Ugh. Yeah, I, I've, I've been, look. I've been down bad for Chani since uh, I, I can't even remember. <laughs> I can't even remember. Whoa. Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay. Oh, don't you tap, don't you tap your fingers up like that, Kay? 
Okay. Oh my gosh, her voice is actually so cool for this little vibrato part though. It's actually so perfect for this little vibrato part. But oh my gosh, Kay. Kay is dangerous. Yeah, see, this is, I think this is Faye. Uh, hello. You have abs. Uh, you know, the blue hair, the choker. Okay, I don't know who this is, but, uh, we need to change that, apparently. Okay. Pam? Okay, the body roll. Look, she doesn't quite have the same sauce Yan does, I'm gonna be honest. But then again, who does? <laughs> Literally, no one has the same sauce Yan does. So, that was gonna be an impossible task. I like she's more aggressive with it though, less sultry, more aggro. So it does stand out. It's not. Oh my. Uh. Oh. Hip movements. The hip movements. Okay. Oh. Judy is barking at me and crawling. Help me. Help me. Yo, that, that energy from Chidi and Chandi is not something I needed here. Woo. Dude, Kay's voice is so good for this descending vibrato part. It's so good for this part. Flip mark. That's so disrespectful. Mm, abs. I think that was K on the vibrato again. Mm. Oh, the body rolling. Oh, the body rolling. Oh my gosh. I think Ellie is the sauciest part of this performance, by the way. She is determined to body roll me to death. <laughs> She is determined to body roll me to death. She is way feeling herself. Ugh. Chadney said I've been doing these concepts since before you were even born. Okay, dude, Kay's voice on this song is crazy. Oh. 
floor. Tony, if you could kindly put the tongue back in your mouth, we could listen. If you could please, if you could kindly put the tongue back in your mouth, everything will be fine. It's all good. No one has to get hurt, and by no one I mean me. What you are currently doing. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Oh, they get the rain this time. Wait, they got the explosion and the rain. Wait, I'm confused. <laughs> I thought Charismatic got the rain and then they got the explosion, but I guess they got the explosion and the rain. Maybe they're separate benefits and they won both benefits somehow. Uh, yeah, I don't know what the hell that was from Chani at the end. But, uh, I'm dead. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, center as she deserves. As she deserves. Yeah, I don't know. Apparently, that we'll learn about the benefits, maybe, about the rain and explosions at some point. Um, okay. This one is less cut and dry than the other version. So, so with Charismatic, I just definitely like the first version, uh, the first team's performance better. Because I just, I think Jihan and Juwon in particular really elevated that beyond. So I think that whole performance was kind of better. I think this one, I like the vocal parts more on this. Um, which is not to down talk Bora, because Bora is obviously incredible. Um, but Kay's voice is so airy. It's so nice on this song. Like, Kay's voice lends kind of a, a lightness to the vibratos that feels surreal. It feels like it's, it's like, not part of the song, almost. Like, it feels too, almost too pretty for the song, but it works really well. Bro, Ellie is just murdering people the whole time. Like, yeah, Quiso center now. Miru center now. But I'm just like looking at Ellie this whole time. Okay, well, wait, listen, when Chen Li center, I am looking at Chen. Like, I'm not gonna pretend. Ugh. Ugh. But yeah, K absolutely ate this whole song. I think K, I like her parts better than all the vocal parts on the first version. Um, K just something about her voice is so cool for this. And the energy and everything she's giving is crazy. I think Ellie gave, like, one of the best performances across everything, across both of both groups. Uh, and Chandy is just so unbelievably sexy. She's just... I, I don't know how, but she's just... You put Chandy in a miniskirt, and my head just goes. My head is gone. My brain does not exist. Oh, we're body rolling. Oh my. Bro, Ellie is crazy. And she's really hot too. I I I think I think no, I think like Ellie absolutely destroyed this start to finish i think chani in a sexy concept is just gonna be unbeatable because uh, uh, she's a sexy queen forever okay um and man k's voice on this song really really takes all the vocal parts somewhere really cool like really cool
Uh, the, the, like, this part, Yan did it way better, no offense, but Yan is just, she's a goddess, and she absolutely destroyed. Um, Yan obviously did that part way better. Yuki did the, like, second rap parts better. Um, man, K, though, absolutely pop off. Like... Like, Kay is just, just, look at the, sorry, look at the smirk from Ellie. Uh, we so actually, with the lip bites, is actually so unreasonable, though, too. Everyone killed it. Everyone killed it in both versions. I was just comparing. I think this one, there's some elements I like way more than the other one. Uh, mostly the vocal part. And... Charismatic performances, I think the whole first performance is better. This one, I like the vocal part more. Um, yeah, everyone killed it, though. I'm very excited for the show. Like I said, I'm going to be watching it on Twitch. Twitch.tv slash Um, We're going to be watching it as close to week to week as possible. Uh, and then, of course, we're going to be watching... Uh, and then those will be on Patreon shortly after uh, the live. Uh, yeah. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a lovely rest of your day. And please remember to stay in your peace. Welcome to my palace. Champagne in your chalice. Even I'm not swinging forward on me. Try that a voice so we can't deep. Rolling around the world.